Well, this feels a bit weird. Um, hello everyone. Now I know what you're thinking. Joe, it's been two months. Where the hell have you been? Um, well, I've kind of been busy. Uh, turns out I'm not as a bad dancer as I thought. And I've actually got pretty far on the old Strictly Come Dancing TV show. Oh, cool. Well, that's great and everything, but you know, we want, we want a video. And I want the ability to fly. But we can't have it all, can we? Now, I know I've been gone a while, but I did want to share this video with you because this is something that I'm genuinely really, really excited about. Now, as you may or may not know, I'm really into the idea of solving crimes, murder mysteries, things like making a murderer, things like Black Mirror, all that kind of stuff. Uh, at the moment, I'm properly, properly into it. And I've discovered this app, right, which I am genuinely obsessed with. I'm so into it that it's kind of scaring me a little bit. Now this app is called Unread. It's like a real time storytelling platform. Now there's multiple stories that you can follow that range from like crime to murder mystery to romance even. And these real time stories can last anywhere between three to 10 days. But what you're about to see in this video is me actually playing one of these stories. And you will see it's like you get the phone of for example, a girl that's gone missing, you get her phone essentially through your phone. You can look through all her messages, you can look through the, their stories at the top, to try and figure out the crime and get to the end of it and work out what exactly happened. But the thing that makes this scarily good is that you get real-time notifications come through whilst you play the experiences. So for example, the girl's gone missing, you've got her phone, you do the first day, but then the second day you wake up and you've got all these notifications come through of like people that have messaged her WhatsApp or updated their story. So you actually, as you go through the experience, you gradually uncover the mystery and figure out what exactly gone on and you figure it out for yourself, which is incredible and I blooming well love it. And these real-time updates from the form of like stories, voice notes, there's photographs, there's links to websites and things. So it really does feel scarily real. It genuinely feels like you're solving an actual mystery. Now, as you're about to see, I'm about to play one for myself. I hope you enjoy it. I know you guys love this kind of thing on my gaming channel. So I thought I'd do the first episode in here. And you know, if it goes well, we'll carry it over onto the gaming channel. Let me know what you think. And without further ado, enjoy episode one. Okay, so for this episode, we're gonna go with my last three days. Which underneath says, it kills to be famous, and it's a horror. Great. So strap yourselves in. I'm sorry it's not happening around Halloween time, but this is what you get. I've been a busy boy, all right? So here we go. Let's play my last three days. You have the phone of a viral superstar. All right, sweet. Josie King is murdered after a video of her singing goes viral. And now you feel love. Relive the last three days of her life through her phone and discover who's behind her murder. Ooh, I love this. We can be doing a murder mystery together on the Thatcher Joe. Who'd have thought it? Right, okay, let's start the experience in three, two, one, start story. Okay, here we go. An unread original. You're through to boot camp! Okay, we know she's a keen reader. She's got a lot of books behind her. Creepy picture of her child. We've all got those in our family homes. A singing award. She's got a lava lamp, which means it could be set in the early 90s. And she's on the front of a magazine. So she was very good. Someone's writing. What the hell just happened? Who the hell was that? Oh, so she's live streaming. And I've just seen something. She's doing a live stream. I just heard screams. Is she okay? I think someone broke into her house. Oh my god, this feels very scarily real. Okay. So it's nine o'clock at night. Oh my god, I hope she's okay. Josie, why has it gone quiet? Oh no, broken cereal bowl. I'm calling the police. This doesn't feel right. I mean, it definitely doesn't feel right. There's a bloody knife on the floor. Oh my god, guys, this is serious. Uh, yeah, she's she's uh, she's dead. She's definitely dead. Josie, answer me. Or Josie, what's her name? I don't know. Oh, it's giving me goosebumps already. I've actually got goosebumps. Oh, she's back alive again. Wait, I'm so confused. What just happened? Okay, so it's nine o'clock. Oh, we're going back in time now. Back in time to 10.40 a.m. Okay, so we now have the phone of Josie or Jossie. I'm not quite sure what her name is. It's her background on her phone. As you can see, it's her and her singing pals. This feels so weird. Okay, slide to unlock. 
These are messages the character has received. You can read them by clicking on them, okay? Here you'll see photos and videos that contacts are sharing. Sometimes these videos will be live. They last for 24 hours before disappearing. Okay, cool. When you receive a new message, there'll be a notification next to the message. You'll soon start receiving real-time messages. Until then, explore the character's messages and get the up to date with the story so far. Right, so we're currently on her phone. She's got messages from her dad. Dad, new phone. I do the same thing. I'm the exact same sort of person. Whenever I get a new contact on my phone, I never delete their old one. I always keep it and just put dad new or dad new new or dad new new new. I'm currently on, I think, dad new 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 new. Have a lovely time, dad. Hope you have a safe flight, we say. Uh, he said, just about to take off now. Try not to burn the new house down while I'm away. I think she's done worse than that. She's gone and got herself murdered. I left the spare key under the plant pot by your front door in case you get locked out. Thanks, Dad. Okay, so the dad's away. We know the dad's away. So it can't be the dad that's killed her. Let's look at some of these stories. Okay, let's look at our own story. When you're home alone. Okay, she's done a boomerang when she's home alone. She's loving life. Harriet. Morning, everyone. Z. Classic hand claw. Pose. Dad at the airport, bright and early. There he is. Look, dad's at the airport. Dad, sit. Dad, the dad is on it with social media. He's even tagged the city airport. Perfect start to my trip. It would be if he didn't give a black pudding. I think that kind of ruins it. Not gonna lie. Too much toast as well. Taking off on my private jet. Oh, he's a show off. He's a flexer. Classic. The dad's a flexer. I don't trust him now. I don't trust the dad. He's definitely a flexer. Just kidding. Ah, oh, okay, saved it. Flying with the ordinary people. Okay. And then he's managed to do a story whilst in the air, which means he has Wi-Fi on board. Hmm. I'm getting more and more suspicious. Okay, so here we have a surprise group chat, which goes on for a long time. Okay, so Harriet's in this group chat, and that's the girl that did this hand pose earlier on, I think. Josie, Cam! Oh, Josie, Josie, Cam and I have done something. Oh my god, what? Haha, <laughs> don't freak out, Jay! Okay, don't hate us, but we decided to take an ex executive decision and put us on the internet, lol. What? Yeah. You idiots, where is it? Please take it down. If there's one bad comment, I'll take it down, I promise. Until then, it's staying up. Harriet is the worst kind of friend. Shit, that I would not enjoy that at all. I'm sorry, Harriet, that would really annoy me. Harry, please take it down, I sound terrible. Oh my god, you don't. I hate hearing myself on video. You sound... good. This is eight days ago. Jay, have you checked your vid? There's now more than 100,000 views. This is like a dream. I'm so proud of you, Josie. And you've got fans. You've got no fans. I'm literally her biggest fan. Okay, so some magazine wants to write about me. Oh my god, she sent a picture through. It's called Rocco. You heard of it? Trying to tell if it's legit or not. Doesn't look very legit. Of course I have. Yeah, nice one, Jay. Do you know what I don't like about Cam? Too many exclamation marks. Way too many. What is he playing at? That's kind of suspicious. I'm so on edge playing this game. Do you remember Melanie from school? This was yesterday. Who? Melanie the felony? Lol, yeah, I forgot we always called her that. Bloody criminal. Surprised she's not insi still inside. Forgot to tell you she's been messaging me, lol. Amazing how people can come out the woodwork when you make it. I know, tell me about it. We barely even spoke at school. Oh god, what if she's looking for more houses to rob? Melanie the felony, yeah. She could be a prime suspect. Oh, Melanie's message, look. Oh, she hasn't replied at all, not once to Melanie. Josie, remember me from school? I know we haven't spoken for like 10 years, but I saw the video on the internet by Josie King. I checked it out. I can't believe it's the same Josie King I went to school with. How cool. How you doing? We should defo catch up. Now you're a big shot singer. Okay, Harriet, Cam, Perry, security alert. What security alert? We have noticed some suspicious activity on your account. To verify your identity, please reply with the answer to which your security question. Where was your mother born? Carmona. Thank you for c confirming your identity. I don't believe that. Little wise tip from me, guys. If anyone ever asks your security questions, don't give it to anyone. Let's see what Harriet's saying. He never guessed who messaged me today. Who? Who do you think? Oh, he must not be named. Yes, him. What did he want? Oh, let me guess. Your heart forever until death do you part? Ha, bingo. Don't forget to collect your prize on the way out, winky smiley. He just needs to chill out. He had his chance and he blew it. Okay, so we've now got a jealous ex-boyfriend on the case. Another potential prime suspect. Prime suspect alert right now. Boyfriend. Write it down. It's like Cluedo. I love this. You need to seriously just move on and find yourself a new guy to show you that you've moved on that way. At least he has no chance. But why should I? I don't want to get with anyone at the mo. Surely just telling him I've moved on should be enough. Okay, so Harriet has let us know that she's got a boyfriend who's not quite over her. A little bit obsessed with her still even. 
Interesting. Let's look at Perry, because the last message Perry sent was, you're a lying little bitch. And that's worrying. Oh, hey, Josie. Are you there? Are you sure there's nothing going out with you and Cam? Of course not. Why? Well, you know. Know what? You're like always together. Plus, I found this picture of you from a night out a few weeks back. You look incredibly close. I mean, yes, technically they are very close in that picture. They're side by side. You're practically dating. We are just friends. You know that. We've been friends since high school. He's like a brother to me. So you wouldn't mind if I tried to get with him? I guess not. Just do what you want. You sure? It's, this is your chance to speak. Just do it, Perry. I don't care. Okay, thanks, babe. Two days ago. You f***ing liar. I feel so humiliated. Perry, you're totally overreacting. What even happened? You're seeing Cam! He told me himself! You lied to me just to embarrass me! You knew I was going to try to get with him last night, and you didn't tell me you were with him because you wanted everyone to see me get rejected by him! How many more times have I got to tell you, Perry? We're just mates, that's it. I'm done with I'm done with guys for the time being. I'm just happy to do my own thing. I'll tell you what! You're a lying little bitch. And right there is where we're gonna end today's so there you go, that was episode one. Now, if you want to see more of this and you want to help figure out who exactly killed Josie, follow me onto my gaming channel where I'll continue the story. But also, if you don't want to watch me play it or you want to go ahead of me or you want to try a different story, I mean, there's a few on there. We've got one called A Silent Truth. The truth lies in his phone. We've got one called La Now Live. They're streaming every screen, which is a thriller. We've got the big question, will she, won't she? An eight day experience in romance. Or we've got Last Scene Online, a night out they'll never forget, which is when you've got the, the phone of a missing girl, which is definitely the one I'll be playing next. There'll be a link in the description where you can go down there and download the app yourself. It's free, and if you want to play a different story, you can do so. Or if you want to go ahead of me and actually figure out what happened to Josie before I do, go ahead, that'd be great. Anyway, that is it for the video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give it a thumbs up subscribe let me know what your predictions are in the comments below but no spoilers please and i will see you maybe in a couple of weeks time on this channel cheers for watching and i'll see you next time with another sug sunday special goodbye